The Getaway. Released all the way back in 2002, it was inspired by the likes of the British gangster movies such as Snatch and Get Carter. However, as a game I always noticed on my shelves growing up, it had that very like bold black and yellow aesthetic that really popped for me. Uh, but I always kind of just assumed that it was maybe like an inferior GTA clone or like a poor English take on the series. I was too deep in that colourful 80s aesthetic of Vice City, I think, to give it a second thought. As a kid anyway, but today I aim to right these wrongs. Is it an underrated classic or is there a reason GTA prevailed? Find out today on Steamy Streamers. Oh my god, this actually looks quite clean on PS3. Yeah, hey, what's with a bird, Harry? She's one of Charlie's specials. Special. Oh my god, the accents! Special people with special jobs. She used to be on the game until she found her true calling. She was a raw proper geezer. She does some wet jobs. Charlie says they never see it coming from a bird. What? She's a topper. Oh, yeah, <laughs> mate. She's not the slightest bit squeamish about a bit of claret. Kind of love this already, I'm not going to lie. Kid. She is fine. The this looks like very good for 2002. Is and that what correct? Are you looking at? Your to say. beautiful face. Good. Fucking Charlie. This is well done, man. This what? level of, um... Watch and learn something. You move when I tell you to move. Acting for 2002 game. It's given GTA a serious run for its uh, cutscene money. I'm assuming this is an open world game, though. I mean, when did the PS2 come out in 2000? 2001? You can't say that on YouTube, sir, please. The belly button out very early noughties. Dodgy! Are you my mummy? <laughs> I don't like you very much. Could we have a word? We've got a few questions we'd like to ask you. Yeah? Who's asking? We'd like to She's got a serious six head. If we could. You're not the police. Since when the police start dressing like common tar. <laughs> Burn! Run out! Get him in the car! <laughs> what the hell? Shut him up! Zeus! Okay, everyone did a good job except him. Oh my god! Bloody Oh my god, is it gonna go like, I am the child 20 years later, getting my sweet revenge? Or maybe I play as the kid like Bully. Get off me. Oh my god! Uh oh. This... ...is quite the intro. I'm getting very heavy rain. Justin! Justin! <laughs> okay, that scream left a bit to be desired. Okay, I am very excited. <laughs> I'm very excited right now. No way. Wow, this looks very good. Indicators? Hang on. Is there camera angles? Is there radio stations? But something tells me this is a bit more cinematic than... Um, oh, sorry. Wrong way. Oh, excuse me. Sorry. Please, please, woman. Sorry, sorry. Hello. How how do I reverse? <laughs> oh, it's triangle. Okay, triangle to reverse. I got it. Yeah, I I gotta see what's up. This looks incredible. Like, can I knock people down in this? Oh, you can. Oh my God, you can. He matched the color of my car, though. No one will ever know. <laughs> Incredibly impressed. Obviously, they're they're definitely maybe this looks like it could be a little bit more cinematically scripted because. We obviously got in-game music right now rather than like a kind of a radio... WH Smith? I mean, don't get me wrong, I don't have one of them, but I'm pretty sure I know... The oh, video Europe? <laughs> I, I was lying about the latter one. Okay, once if I kill the police woman? Okay, no one, no one cares. The indicator's on still, though. All right, this is incredibly impressive looking. <laughs> As I said, very impressed for PS2 so far. Okay, I'm going to follow the car this time. Just going to stop off the video Europe, though, very quickly. Dude, can I, can I knock down these poles? Okay, very true to real life. Very interesting. If I... Oh, very interesting. I can use the right analog stick to move up for acceleration and back for... to reverse. Also, guys, if you're enjoying uh, this style of video, please consider dropping a like. Tell me in the comment down below as well if you ever played this game. I'd love to know information on it. I'd love to know what it was going for. Um, oh, the car is... the car is... the car is broken. Can I... Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Disco Inferno! Oh no! I'm starting to think very quickly that the getaway is not quite a GTA clone. Um, 
There is people on the street, but I have a sneaking suspicion I'm not going to be able to walk around. Hi, turns out I might have been wrong about that. Uh, so yeah, thanks. Enjoy the video. I mean, I hope I can. And maybe, you know, this is just giving me like a... Oh my, oh my god. It just feels like they put a little bit too much effort into the car. Like, my gamer knowledge tells me that how good these cars look for 2002 and the brandedness of them. What's this, a Skoda? Like, these are, these are real cars, right? So, my feelings are that maybe... Wait, did he go left or straight? I can't tell. Tunes. Oh, I'm supposed to go left. That's what the indicator is for. Very interesting. Okay. Okay, now I'm really starting to feel like this is definitely more of a... Uh, uh, well, Simpsons and Run had running sections, but it was primarily driving. Oh, my God. Something tells me I'm not going to be doing anything but driving. Which I'm very okay with, because, I mean, look, look how beautiful this is. I was wondering, I was like, this isn't very impressive. Do you know what I mean? Come on, Skoda. Wait, maybe we're okay. All right, she's not looking too hot. Sorry. Oh my God. Excuse me, please. Okay. <laughs> I've embarrassed myself for the last time. It's very hard to control though. I'm, I'm not, not gonna lie. Like I am a struggling. Does the getaway have a natural difficulty? Because what happens is I don't control the drift. So if I turn too much, it is it's going into serious drift mode. This is a tune though. I mean, I, I'm wondering that, I think there is sequels to this game. Um, I'm not sure did they expand on that. The same with like Driver, right? Driver was a series that um, I, I think in the in the later games you could get out of the car if I'm not mistaken. I'm also looking for other quality games you would love to see me play and experience for the first time. I do try and use all original hardware and discs to the best of my ability to get that classic vibe. This is difficult! <laughs> Will I get past the... Is this notoriously like the car is not moving anymore? This It's literally breaking down as I speak. Will I be able to get past the first mission? Oh my god, find out next time on Steamy Streamers. <laughs> also, if you enjoy this type of content, you can check out the streams at kick.com forward slash steamy underscore streamers. Doing a Majora's Mask playthrough at the moment. Enjoy a fair bit of the scuff too. Ah, and the car's on fire. And I'm burning in the car. I refuse to get out of the car. The Getaway is an action-adventure video game developed by Team Soho and published by Sony. It was released on the 11th of December 2002, inspired by the British gangster films, okay, such as Get Carter and Snatch. The game was planned to be released alongside the launch of the PlayStation 2, but it was delayed over two years due to the difficulty of recreating the large areas of London, which I can see very clearly they've done a great job on. The Getaway is an open-world action-adventure game? No way. Open world act? No way! Oh my god, I am... Due to the similarities of Grand Theft Auto series, often labeled as a GTA clone. The game features a number of licensed vehicles. That is blowing my mind. Okay, free look when weapon is holstered. Oh my god, this is not a car game. I, I was so wrong. Forgive me. I, I'm, I'm in shock right now. Okay, or one is handbrake. Exit the vehicle in circle. Can I get out of the vehicle straight away? Oh! <laughs> I my mind is blown. I could never have been so wrong. I have never been so wrong in all my life. Holy shit. This is impressive. Okay, I don't have camera control, which is unusual. So triangle to take out my gun. How do I shoot? I uh, my mind is blown. My mind is absolutely blown. Holy mother of god, this looks incredible. I am speechless at how good this looks. This is one of these games that is really enjoying the backwards compat compatibility mode, I guess, because obviously they spent a lot of time on getting the place looking very london -esque. But yeah, I would love to hear any of your stories growing up. Obviously, I know nothing about this game, so, you know, we're experiencing it for the first time together. So apologies for, uh, you know, well, no apologies, but you know what I mean? Apologies for not being any knowledge on it and, you know, experiencing as we go. Oh my god, this is incredible. I'm also seriously considering now um, playing this on stream. You know, if, if, if people enjoy this video and they would like to see this continued. Like, that damage is impressive. That is incredibly impressive. And then what happened this series? Where did it go? Like, I'm already blown away and I haven't made it past the first minute of the video game. <laughs> okay, you drove into me! Ted Baker! <laughs> I have Ted Baker shoes. Fancy? I think so. Is it known to be notoriously difficult is the other question. Because like, 
There's not a lot of space for me here not to murder people or crash. This is, uh, yeah, this is looking unfortunate. Un wait, wait, can I get out of a car and get into another one? Just get out. Okay, so I have to stop completely. Okay, gonna roll in front of another car. Sir, sir, let me in. Oh my, oh my god. <laughs> oh, this game is amazing. I'm sorry, sir. Okay, keep an eye on the indicator. Is obviously gonna be that uh, game mechanic, which you know what? Very cool game mechanic. Oh my god, get out of my way. Get out of my way! Oh, oh. <laughs> Dude, I, I love this. I love this. This is incredible looking. I am like slightly jaw dropped here, guys. Oh my god, I made it! I made it! No way. Hello? Where do I go? Oh my god. This looks so good. If they remaster this, holy, holy, holy hell. Hi, sir. Oh, wait! Wait! I wasn't taught how to play the video game! Ah! <laughs> Harry said what? Is there a run button? Oh my god, the blood is great as well. Okay. I oh. 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 Okay, there we go. Or one to lock on. Oh my I can so there's um I've played all the GTAs, the 3D ones. I've streamed them completely. And um, this may be the best GTA clone that I've never played. In fact, this is the title <laughs> of my video. <gasps> I am in shock and awe. Oh, look at the animation of him holding his, his injured. Well, I mean, he's, he's, he's far more than injured. He's very close to death, I would imagine. This well, is... Can I pick this up? <gasps> I can't take much more of this. I... I am in shock. Like, genuine, authentic, first-time reaction to this. And I am in absolute shock. I mean... No, let me just get out the game manual here again real quick. All right, if you could, sir, if you could wait there for a minute. Sorry, okay, so L2, reload weapon. Oh my god, there's so unusual stuff here. Okay, just keep shooting me. Sir, please stop. Free look when weapon is holstered. Ah! Or when take aim, tap to change target. Okay, so or one's gonna be the big one. Excuse me, sir. I, I was unarmed. I was reading the controls to uh, free aim. Ah, oh, here we go. Okay, so L2 then just to free aim. These options. Oh, there we go. That's the boom I was looking for. That is the... Oh, my God. The destructible environment? It didn't just explode? You're joking me. I'm dual wielding. <laughs> oh, God, shoot. I keep forgetting the controls. The controls are a little bit, a little bit uh, non-intuitive compared to everything else I've played. But I understand because they have so much like features. This is so much fun. This is so much fun. <laughs> wow! Wow! Oh my god! Oh, oh! That's a shotty. That's a shotty too, hotty. Like the the damage. I'm like, I know these are just textures, but there's stuff. I think that's Foster's. <laughs> is it? Is that Foster's? I, I pick up that shotgun. I, it's kind of unusual though. I do seem to just pick up whatever. Like I'm not doing anything to pick up weapons. Fucking. Whew. Oh, I, like this is GTA 4 level of detail. Like the movement. I mean, I know I'm exaggerating a little bit, but like the the, the attention to detail just with textures and stuff is is excellent. Uh, please consider dropping a like, a sub, and sharing with a friend. And I would love, genuinely, genuinely love if you could tell me your experiences with this. Because the reason I love making these videos is bringing back nostalgia. Or playing a retro game for the first time um, and sharing that experience with someone. So whether on this channel it's a game I've played before, whether it's one I've never played. Uh, the big reason I really, really want to do this is just to, to share stories and, and get your experiences growing up with them. Um, reload weapon. Okay, character controls. What the fuck is he? I won't make it. I mean, excuse me, I didn't I did not say any bad words. Okay. F some of that. This is so excellent. I, I just I'm just so chuffed about this right now. No! <gasps> the fact that the shit is Oh, I mean sorry, excuse me, I didn't mean to curse. The fact that <laughs> the fact that it's leaking from the the attention to detail is this game feels good. I mean, don't get me wrong, it feels a little sluggish, but, like, it also feels satisfying. Like, it, 
I mean, the fact that there is, you know, Game Design 101. Now, Game Design 101 fooled me very heavily earlier because I did not expect this game to be so, so good. <laughs> I, I truly didn't. Um, okay, wait, can I shoot this window down or something? It looks very opaque. Uh, that I assumed that this was just all of a sudden like a, a racing game. Uh, oh, you're going? fucker. I mean, excuse me. He's here. Who is? Hammond. Oh, fuck. Oh, God, the voice acting is great as well. I mean, don't get me wrong. It's a, it's a little, it's a little ham-fisted, right? Like, it's a little, a little extra. <sighs> what an impressive game. I, I'm, I'm waiting to see, like, the downside and, like, how this hasn't been... Like, obviously, I, I know this, this game has its following, but, like... Here he is. You know, I'm, I'm really, wa I'm really waiting to see... Where this lets me down and how this isn't the greatest PS2 game of all time. Do you know what I mean? Okay, yeah. Uh, oh, the way he just drops it. <laughs> Freeze! I still can't get over that. <laughs> okay, then we go, then we go. Also, like, this just makes me so happy that I did manage to acquire a backwards compatible PS3 because... Playing this, like, the game is also integrated widescreen, it said on the back. And I managed to pick this game up for four euro. With the manual, with the with the poster and the map. Well, the poster map, I think it is. Um, and I can you just, like... That's something that brings me so much joy as a, as a content creator, as a streamer, as just someone who's passionate about video games, is the, the ability just to, you know, on the weekend pick something up like this and just get so much joy out of it for, sp and, you know, spending so little on it, right? And just having a brand new discovery. I'm kind of scared. Oh. Oh, this this is looking bad for me. I'm not going to lie. Regenerative health would be sick in this. Also, there's no HUD, I just realized. This game is uh, similar to my King Kong video, which you can check out too. Uh, it's HUDless. So, looks like a strike. Inf oh, yes. Johnson, you bastard. That was a... That wasn't a great move on my half. Like, when you're coming in to save your child, you should definitely survey the room. Like, the character models. Not much character models look like this in 2002, I hate to tell you. He's with us again. At least from a realistic point of view. Turn it up a little bit. Morning, sunshine. Raw night. You again. Do you sleep well? You look a little drowsy. Grievous. Bring the boy around. I want his undivided attention. <laughs> Smelling salts. Now slowly Where's jelk me. Son, you <laughs> fat bastard. Patience, <laughs> mark my boy. Only good time. Yeah, fat bastard, sorry. man. I eat because I'm so sad, really and I'm sad because I eat. <laughs> Is there any way to greet an old friend? Stop talking and start listening, Hammond. You're in no position to be making demands. What's this all about, Charlie? I thought you'd retired. You know I have. I'm not with the Collins' gang anymore. You know that. I'm running a nightclub. I've been out nearly two months and I'm not in the life. I don't do this shit anymore! Relax, son. You'll do yourself an injury. I'll do you an injury, Charlie. I'll fucking swear I'll kill you. Get back here. Get back here. Eyebrows. Sorry. Eyebrows. Yourself. Make the boy listen. Let the boy watch. <laughs> like I learned from his father and he learned from my father. Boy? Put him in the chair. Uh oh, not the chair. The chair is instantly reminding Casino Royale where Daniel Craig, is that his name? Got his bollocks whipped. <laughs> and he was like, more, more. But he was into it, which I mean, fair play to him, you know? Who doesn't like a little bit of ball busting? I mean, this, this is the back of the thing. <laughs> this is back the cover I read earlier. If you, you talk to anyone you like, the kid dies. You do exactly what I say. You take a talk shit, anyone, the kid dies. You're late, or you let me down. The kid dies. Your kid dies. <laughs> Gotta make myself clear. If you don't kiss me goodnight, the kid dies. <laughs> it's a decent premise, but I feel like... You know if you're in this world this, that the kid's probably, like, oh. you know, the kid will be used as leverage forever, right? Like, there's just, Such why would you not? Jason! Jason! <laughs> Wait, what was his name? kid's name? Was it Charlie? No, it was the fat bastard Charlie? Hello. What? 
Gotta say the guy liner looks yeah, really good in him. I'm listening. Rise and shine, Marky boy. Did they literally beat him up and knock him out again and put him in the car and wait for him to wake up and then knew exactly? Was there someone outside the car being like, he's waking up, call him. I want you to let Nick Collins know you're no longer friends. What's this all about, Charlie? Oh, he's Charlie, okay. I want you to do a little DIY. I'm not Diddle sure it yourself. I want you to do it every morning and night. I mean, trash it. Smash the place to pieces. Oh, now it looks like we're getting into fire. tutorial mode, kind of, no you know? Wait. GTA likes to do this Don't as well. Destroy something you is your first me. mission. Don't Although the pacing of this is far more down. intense. You're off your fucking rocket, Charlie. That's my old turf. They're friends of mine. You heard me. Just go on it. I'll better be seeing Republic on the six o'clock news, or your boy will be all over the headlines by ten. I don't want any excuses, Hammond. Just do the job if you want to see your kid alive. Yeah, okay, so there's always going to be an indicator telling me where to go. That is an incredible smart game mechanic. Practicality-wise, not sure how well it's going to work out in the long run, but very impressive nonetheless. I mean, the car's controlled pretty well, too, like the way they mount the curb and stuff. Feels pretty realistic. I wonder how big the map is, is the other question. Also, is there... Sorry, no, love. But is there, is there, you know, will I be arrested for knocking people down? They do get it out of the way quite, quite well. Like, yeah, if I go ahead and start shooting people, what's... Let's, let's test the game just a little bit here. Oh, there is! <laughs> this game is awesome! Oh, and you know what? Like, having... Having been visited London a few times, like... This is, this is far, this is far more like... I guess like relatable, right? Obviously again, 2002, so everything looks 2002. Including the police cars, which look almost late 90s, mid 90s maybe even to be honest. Okay, can I get into the, I wanna get into the police car actually. This is incredible. <laughs> this is magnificent. Oh, I can turn on the siren. The only thing this game is missing, the only thing that would elevate this to an incredible height, but obviously I understand why they haven't, because they're going for a very specific mood, which I understand. Oh, let me turn this down again, sorry. Um, a very specific mood would be just the fact of having radio stations. That would, that would make my day. Uh, but guys, of course, as well, please, if, you, uh, if you've enjoyed this, I'd greatly appreciate it. Uh, you know, and I'll comment on your history of how you enjoyed this game. It would, it would mean a lot to me. Um, and yeah, I, I think I will leave it here as I've just been blown away. My, my mind is broken. Um, this has been absolutely incredible. This is, this is the reason why I love video games, is surprises like this. Um, so if you've enjoyed this video, uh, please do drop a like, uh, share it. It would mean the world to me. Uh, and also, if you'd like to check out my retro nostalgic streams on uh, most weekdays, Mondays, Tuesdays, well, Thursdays and Fridays. Wednesdays I'm using as a, a YouTube opportunity. Um, check it out at kick.com forward slash steamy underscore streamers. Finishing off Majora's Mask, playing Need for Speed Underground 2. And uh, we do some community games as well. So if you'd like to be uh, join a like-minded nostalgic community, uh, we would love to have you over there. But until next time, thank you for hanging out for the getaway. And uh, I will see you all next time. Bye.